Many requested a video on soul strategies and not date. Here we go. We're lucky to get in this stock early on. The performance has been amazing. However, now we have to face the correction and return to the mean, if you like. So that's a lot, a lot more difficult. Let's see if we can find some kind of levels to look for and define a small strategy for the potential future movement of soul strategies. I personally am better with long-term predictions than short-term predictions, day-by-day -day movements. So let's see what the charts can tell us. This is the weekly chart, so not a lot there, besides the fact that we have quite a lot of volume and that vertical shot in price and a red candle yesterday. So the stock corrected 17%, which is quite a lot, but the stock has gone way more than that. So it's a normal price action for a stock that has exploded in price very quickly. Let's look at the daily, four hour and one hour maybe, let's see where we can see some type of support and resistance levels. On daily, we start to see something, but it's still, it's still quite too long of a time frame to determine where the asset can go. The thing that we can see is an increase in price and now a reduction in volume. MA50, MA200 are exploding up to the right. That's still normal. They don't detect this correction yet because it's too early for it. So let's go to lower time frame. So this is the four hour. And we start to see something that I want to see and something better is the two red candles that you see here, which the first one had huge volume, the second one had lower volume, and I'm expecting the third one maybe will have a smaller volume, and then we can define support level. So at this stage, support level can be 160, maybe even 140. We'll have to find out. It's kind of tricky when the knife is falling quickly right so what you need to do is let it fall don't buy on the way down but wait until it touches some kind of support and shows the first bounce before start looking into it because technically it could correct that down to 60 or even to 20 if you think about it but if the strength of the stock is sufficient that buyers determine that it's cheap at 160 or 140 they will stop the fall at that level and what will determine that well what's influencing the price right now is sole strategies strategy the fact that they are going hard on solana staking and generating passive income for shareholders trying to find money buy more solana or sell Bitcoin like they did yesterday to buy more Solana. So they clearly indicated now that the strategy is to accumulate as much Solana, contribute to Solana blockchain and go hard on Solana. That's pretty much their strategy. If you don't believe in that, then you won't buy the stock and therefore it's going to fall quite a lot. But if you think that Solana will be higher in one month, in two months, in three months, in six months, then it's worthwhile to invest in soul strategies and then it's to define the level at which you, you find it cheap or appropriate to buy this stock. So today's video is mainly on the chart. When I have a little more time, I can dive into the ratio between assets and um, market cap to see what type of multiple we are selling into compare it to Neptune and MicroStrategy and see where we're headed. But right now, maybe 160 could be a support, 140 could be the next one. Let's look at shorter time frames. Now on the one hour, we have a more information still. You see here that we got a correction to 160 or 165 and bounce before. Now we are back to 167, so it's near 165. So this could be actually 
a base level, 165, 160, could be a support level that's coming. For sure, it would be 140 because at the one hour chart, the 140 trend line is already there. And you see the ME200 is already at 60 cents here, way lower. But usually the ME50 will, will be used as support. Due to the fact that we have stopped already at 165, that could be our level right now. And also, if you see here, the one hour candles, the red ones are going down, meaning that there's less and less and less sellers lately. So if the seller volume does not increase, it means that we are selling near 165, 160. That would be my bet, my best guess, but let's see how the stock will open this morning and how it will behave. Now Bitcoin has cooled off and Solana, I think this morning was correcting a little bit. So there's still not a direct correlation between Solana and Sol Strategies. If you are aware of micro strategies and you have followed it, sometimes when Bitcoin goes down, micro strategies goes up. There's not always a direct correlation between what MicroStrategy does and Bitcoin. But the overall trend is respected in both MicroStrategy and Bitcoin. So will we have that type of dynamic between Soul Strategies and Solana? Could be possible. So this is my best guess as of today, October 30th of 2024. Let's see how the day will go in terms of holding 165 or 160 or are we correcting down to 140 keep in mind that it's normal for people who got in at 60 or even 25 30 to take profits at this level it's quite a few X's already so it's not unusual to see a correction at this stage I hope you learn a little bit let's see if Whatever I predicted works, it's not financial advice, it's just my best guess, but I still have full conviction on Solana in this bull run. The altcoin season is not here, right now it's Bitcoin's time, so the banana zone or explosion in altcoin season for Solana is not here yet. It could start by January 2025, let's see if it starts earlier, but i rather be on the asset before it starts pumping to maximize the gains and maybe absorb a little bit of the correction. But that's me with full conviction on Solana for 2024 and 2025.